um, because of, you know, my fate. Oh, you think it's fate? Yeah, like, I'm not supposed to win. I can win, but I'm not supposed to win. Like, I can't, I can't, I can't place a bet to win on myself. Like, I can't bet on myself. I have to bet on my opponent. So if I bet on my opponent, I'll win, and they'll lose. But but what happens then, though, is that if I win and they lose, then everybody doesn't like me. They don't like you? No, no, because they wanted them to win. So I'm the enemy. You're the enemy? Yeah, like like the not I'm not the enemy, but like just like I lose everything if I win. If I if I win or if they if I let them win, then everybody's happy. Oh, that's how that's how I feel sometimes. I feel like if I let somebody else win, then everybody else is happy. If I win, I'm happy, but nobody else is. You get what I'm saying? You ever feel that way? Like you gotta, it's like you gotta like you gotta let you gotta let them win, so that. That um, I don't know. That so that the like the balance, like there's balance. Yeah, to keep the world balanced. But sometimes, sometimes when you do that too much, I think that's when things get out of hand. They do. Yeah, like it it falls on somebody else. The problem. So like like if um, all right, let's let, let's use. Let's use professional wrestling as a as a gauge. Okay, so when we were a kid, um, no matter what, how old you were when you started watching it, or if you, even if you didn't watch it, but you still know who Hulk Hogan is. Okay, Hulk Hogan was the good guy, the king. You know, he was he was the good guy, but they made it that way. He had to win to keep all the kids happy. And, um, and like, everybody wanted Macho Man to win. He wanted Macho Man to win. They did? Yes. Everybody wanted Macho Man to win. But they never, they, like, they let Macho Man be, like, the second fiddle to Hulk Hogan. And then... I don't know, can I dance, guys? I don't know, I have to ask permission from the chat. Guys, give me, give me yeses in the chat if I can dance. And, um, so, so, then years go by... And then the the attitude era is in town, in in full of, and then who do you got? You got Stone Cold and The Rock, right? Well, Stone Cold was Hulk Hogan, and The Rock was the Macho Man, but they 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 uh, they um, they 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 called an audible in the attitude era because Hulk uh, because Stone Cold left. He he got hurt. His neck. He couldn't wrestle anymore, so he took he took a hiatus, and and that's when The Rock went from and and like you know got out of that funk he was in because he was in a funk because what happened with Triple H is before before Stone Cold did his thing and before The Rock did his thing, Triple H was with the Click with Kevin Nash. Um, Scott Hall and like before they were NWO and they left for WCW and did the thing with Hogan they were they were they were a group of friends and when they left when they were gonna leave that hit and Shawn Michaels too they were in a cage match and so the bad guys and the good guys were in the ring together and that did, they weren't supposed to do that and like before YouTube they took a bow like they 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 took about and so um, they weren't happy. The guys in the back weren't happy. Like you guys shouldn't have done that. What the? It was because it was it was a it was a it was a like a rule. Like you don't do that. You know, like what the heck were you thinking? 
And so they all left, so they don't give a crap. We're not going to be here anyway. We're going to the, we're going, you know, we're going to Walmart because Kmart sucks. You know, that, that was their, that was their M.O. They worked for Kmart for so long, and then they found out Walmart paid better, so they left. Yeah. They get to do the same thing, just in a, you know, just for, for more money. And so they left, and, and Shawn Michaels and um, Triple H stayed, but Shawn Michaels was a top guy, and they weren't going to. They weren't going to punish him, but they said, we got to punish you to Triple H. So they punished Triple H. And he went, you know, whoosh, bottom of the barrel. He had to do that stupid, he had to do a stupid gimmick where he was like a French guy and wore like fancy gear and blah, blah, blah. And then, then he was just, you know, tr um, Shawn Michaels' sidekick for a couple of years. Yeah. Ooh. What do I think of all elite wrestling? We'll get to that. We'll get to that. Let me let me talk about. Let me finish this. Let me finish this talk first, and then we'll. I'll give you my two cents on all elite wrestling. He became the, and then he and then he started. Um, D, they started D Generation X. And they started that thing, and they, they created this new movement, and everybody loved it. Yep. And um, then um, um, something happened. Shawn Michaels got hurt and had to leave. So guess who had to lead DX? Triple H. And that's when Triple H got his power. After Shawn Michaels got hurt, Triple H got his power. He didn't get all of it, but he got some of it. Yep. And then, um, um, Vin, uh, Vince, the owner of the wrestling, of WWF, it was WWF, the, Vince, um, had his daughter, he did a, he did a, um, a story with his daughter, with The Undertaker and Stone Cold, and it was like, it was like a big, it was a big, um, thing, and then Triple H, um, Triple H, um, got into it, uh, Months later, after, because um, the corporate ministry was a thing, and Stephanie was dating Test. Test was a wrestler, and uh, something happened with uh, something happened with with so Triple H took her, like took her, and they they went to Vegas, and she was drugged or whatever, passed out, and he married her in Vegas. And then that was the joke. That was like, and then the next, the next week, um, um, she, she's, you know, she's pretending to like she doesn't love him and like, I hate you, I hate you. And then, it all, it all backfired. There was a match at a pay per view, and she turned on her dad, and she got with Triple H. So it was a ruse the whole time. She, so she did love Triple H. And what happened was. She was really dating him. Like, they started dating after that storyline. Yep. Woo! Have an amazing evening, okay? I see you're busy. Just wanted to stop in and share support. Oh, thank you, Raven. Woo! They did this storyline with, with them and the DX group. And... That went on for at least a year, and then um, the Rock, the Rock was the good guy for a while, but um, it was getting it was getting like rough because the Rock was um, the Rock was picking up some stuff outside of wrestling, like SNL, and then you know there were movie talks before he went, you know, before he was going to Hollywood. So, so he was kind of like, he was kind of like, you know, he, with, with Dwayne, he was in that moment where he was like, uh, oh, you're going to be able to host SNL. And that opened windows and doors for him, for, to other movies. I go, that guy's really funny. That guy can really act. He's really, and he's really talented. So, so that opened doors for him. And then, um, Stone Cold. Like right after, I'd say right after The Rock did SNL, 
Stone Cold came back. Or or some, something happened. There was something going on with, like, Stone Cold and, and The Rock came back at the same night. Like, almost the same night or whatever. Like, they made a return. And, he, and he's like, it's not Stone Cold? Then who the heck is it? And it was The Rock, and everybody's like, "Yeah, he got the big, he got one of the biggest pops I've ever heard, I've ever seen." And then, so, so The Rock was never a bad guy after after that. Well, he did once after, so after he left to um, go do the Scorpion King, and he came back. Um, he was cool for a little bit. And then um, he, he he it was like when he did Walking Tall or something he he cut his hair a little bit and he became a bad guy again uh, but he was like Hollywood Rock yeah he was Hollywood Rock and um, he he did a match with Goldberg when Go when they brought Goldberg in and uh, that that was okay but it was you know I don't know. It would have been cool if they did the opposite. Like, if they let Goldberg in and be a bad guy and, like, The Rock came back and just... I think I think that would have been a better... I Honestly, I would love to see if they do that again. Like, if, uh... Like, they did the opposite where, like, Goldberg's just, like, everybody's just sick of Goldberg at WrestleMania or something like that. And then it's like, if you smile, yeah. And he goes out and he freaking rock bottoms Goldberg and like does the people's elbow. I was like, yeah. Woo. I think that would be awesome. And like, um, even though even though it makes Goldberg look like a punk, it kind of, he can go out on a high note. You know, it's like, yeah. I would if, if if I had only if if I, if it was gonna be my last match, I would want I would want the crowd to be screaming their ears off, and I think sometimes the bad guy has to lose and sometimes the bad guy has to win. Just depends. Yeah, it depends. Depends on the crowd. It's like you gotta play with that crowd, and I think if they would have done something like that, it would have been it would have been cool. But like it was different then because. Goldberg was never in WWE. Yeah. My favorite female is China. Oh yeah, I, I was gonna talk about her, but I didn't wanna. I didn't wanna get so mushy, like, cause um, she they did her dirty. Yeah. But um, you know, she 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 uh, you know, at least she didn't quit. You know, and she got she got she got a. You know, she did fine on her own. She did better on her own. But she got hurt too. Because um, she was, you know, she was the it person. So she was always working and always wrestling every night. And they didn't do that thing they're doing now where the main eventer doesn't wrestle at all. Until until the um, until the big pay per view or premium live event, which that's what's hurting WWE is. Um, um, they they're not building these new guys. Just like, all right, what do we do after we acknowledge you, Roman? <laughs> it's like, okay, is somebody gonna run down and fight you, or like, what? Like, what is going on? Oh, and then they got Sammy Zayn. Sammy Zayn is like Mick Foley Jr. Yeah. Thank you. And and uh. I don't know. They're just like guys that I want to see pushed, and they're not pushing them. But it's not because they don't want to. It's because they're not ready. Yeah, they're not ready for the push. Yeah, they're not ready for the push. Like I want Ridge Holland and um, like Sheamus. 
Like, I want their group to kind of... I want to see that guy go on single. Yeah. And then, um, who else? Um, I forget. I'm trying to think who else I want to, want to do good. I, I'm i glad they got, um, uh, what's his name, to, to, uh, to do... Like, he, he, during the pandemic, when they gave him the title... Oh, what was his name? Oh, I forget. Uh, what's his name? God, I forget his name. Dang it. The Scottish guy. Is he Scottish? I don't know. Or Irish. Celtic warrior. Now, that, Seamus is the Celtic warrior. Oh, what's his name? He's got the sword. Who's the guy with the sword? Yeah, I don't know. Um, no, not no. The guy with the sword. Trying to line the line the. Yeah, Drew. Yeah, Drew. Drew. Like that was amazing. Like, and Drew is amazing. Drew. Drew. Drew has it. Whatever. Whatever that he has it. But, but there that sword. I don't, I don't know. He just needs... I don't know what he needs, but he just needs to be like like a Brett the Hitman heart kind of look. But not pink. But like that kind of... That kind of character that just comes out, wins the match, and then, you know, I don't know, like, like a... Like a care... I don't want to say carefree, but just, just like... He, he has he has a look. He has a good he has a good look, but I don't know. I, I'm just I'm not a fan of the sword thing. Yeah, I don't know, but I get it. it it's part of that, you know. Oh, he's got a sword. Ooh. I don't. I I miss the old gimmicks, and I think that's what I think that's what. I think that's what they need to start bringing back into the into the business is gimmicks, cliche gimmicks. You know, that's how people. That's like, like what happened to that? Like what happened to it? I don't know. The get like, like at least AEW kind of has some people with. They're kind of getting gimmicks kind of into it. There is, there's a couple characters that have a good, good gimmick. Like, that's why everybody likes, um, The Fiend. Because it's a gimmick. It's not, you know, it's a dark character. It's, you know, a thing. That's why the Wyatt family did good. That's why everybody likes Woken Matt Hardy, Broken Matt Hardy. And, and that's why people like Jeff Hardy, because he's, he's a character. That's why people liked Finn Balor, the demon Finn Balor, because it's a gimmick. Um, that's why they like those characters. Like, yeah. Like, what's her face? Um, in the, what's that group? The, the dark group. Uh, what do they call them? The fall, not the fall. Oh, what is it? What are they called? Dark? No. What are they called? Dark? Uh, with Thin Dollars Group. What is Thin Dollars Group called? What is, what's their faction called? Judgment Day. Oh, yeah. The Judgment Day. Like, that's a good gimmick. Um. The Alpha Academy is a good gimmick. The, the, um, the primetime players, that's a good gimmick. That's a great, that, that's a great tag team. The New Day was a good gimmick. Yeah. There's still some good guys out there. Um, what's his name is a good gimmick? Um, Dolph Ziggler. The Miz is a good gimmick, has a good gimmick. Yeah. Um... But there's some guys that are just them, like, uh, and sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. But like, it's just like you guys need a gimmick. What are you doing? Like, there, how many guys do you see on TV that have no gimmick? 
Okay, because Roman Reigns has no gimmick. And um, if you put anybody in his group that actually has a gimmick, um, his cousin Solo is the only one. But it's just Umaga Jr. Yeah. And the Usos, the Usos are okay. But, um, they're, they're, um, you know, they're just wearing, they just look like Roman, they just look like Roman's, uh, bodyguards right now. Yeah. Like his posse. It doesn't, it doesn't seem like there's a gimmick there. Yeah, I don't know. And who, oh, who else has... Paul, can I get a free patch? Can you get a free patch? Um, I don't, I don't, I'm not the one selling the patches. That's Jay in that video. So right now I don't have, like, let's just, let, I'd say if you want a free one, you got to wait till I get a PO box and they send me some and then I can, you know, send some out as giveaways or whatever. Um, but I don't have, I don't have the, I don't have the patches. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, or I can, I can, um, I can figure it out. But I was thinking that, um, they would be, they would be good. Like, like, uh, if you bought something, they could send you one for free. Like, like something else. Like you could do a buy one, get one, but that's up to him. So, yeah. So, so suggest it to make make suggestions to to Jay. Jay's the one that's making that stuff on his website. Yeah. And that's how I'm doing things with people. I'm just like, you know, like if you want to sell some merch with my picture on it. Yeah, go do it. Get rich. Get rich. Not everybody, not everybody, not everybody would let you do that, but I would. I would let, I would let everybody use my image. Yeah. I wouldn't care. Because, because my image is everywhere. <laughs> I don't care. Woo. And then I don't have to worry about anything. Like, I, it's like my, my face is on that shirt, but I didn't sell it. I didn't make that. No, nope. somebody else did. Nobody owns my face, so why should I? That's what. That's why I say nobody owns me. So why should I? Well, yeah. Yeah. Why should I? I don't own me. I am me. <laughs> and I, I honestly think like I'll make enough money for myself doing this, doing live streaming, do, you know, doing show, like doing shows and stuff like that. I don't, I don't need to make money off of my merch. Nah. I need to get some merch. I am your biggest fan. Oh. You will. You will. Yeah. You'll get some. Definitely. And what I also say is, like, if some, if, if somebody starts making merch, um, they're going to reward me with, you know, gifts and stuff. I'll be like, yeah, just give away, like whatever, whatever you want to, whatever you want to give away, give it away. Yeah, give it to people. Or, or when I go to a show, you can, yeah, you know, that that's my payment, you know, from you. That's my like, that's the that's like the gift. It's like here, Paul, that's my gift to you. Hey. Or, or I can, you know, sell the, you know, sell them, sell them, and I get to keep the money. <laughs> or whatever, I'll buy them from you, and then I'll sell, or, uh, I wouldn't do that. That's, that's dumb. I won't double dip on my own merch. That would be stupid. Yeah, no double dip in your merch. That means if I, let's say I bought it from, you, from him, and then I took it to, like, a show and sold them to everybody instead of giving them away that's double dipping because I'm just and I might make more and that wouldn't be fair wouldn't be fair to you guys wouldn't be fair to Jay and it would be selfish of me yeah I wouldn't that, that's one people do that yeah they do
to the sport like they'll go to like go to a sporting show and they'll buy out all the sh all the all the popular shirts and then they'll go outside and they'll resell them for twice as much yeah and then and then they, they they'll say oh they're fake it's like they're not fake they're just they just bought them in there and they're out here now they like they sold out in there so they're so, they're basically double dipping yeah did I go on yet? No, it's not till February eighth. February eighth is my my um, vi um virtual edition. Um, you won't be able to see it though. It's 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 a it's a closed audition. And then um, if I get if I get a call back after that, then I can then I get then I get asked to be on the on the on the show. But I'm not holding any breaths. Yep. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna, you know, let the universe decide my fate. Let the world decide my fate. No, I don't. Tommy, I don't. I don't know who that is. I don't know who that is. What's up? Yeah, so so asking or um, to answer the question about AEW, I liked it, but I don't love it. The reason I don't love it is because um, it seems like they it seems like they they they. They invest too much in certain guys. They invest too much time and, and, and energy into these guys. And then um, it backfires. Yeah, it, it backfires each time. And um, I don't know. Like they, like they booked. Um, Dean Ambrose, or what's his name now, or what's his real name? No, it's Dean Ambrose's name. Um, John Moxley. John Moxley. So John Moxley, and then they got CM Punk to come back, and then that backfired. just I don't know he's just a bitter person I think yeah he's so bitter I don't know I don't know what his deal is there's something there's some I I, I don't know I don't want to say there's like something wrong with him but he's got some kind of issue some issue I think his problem is he's hanging out in the wrong with the wrong group of people that's what that's the problem is it's like these guys, the, the guys he hangs out with, they all have different lifestyles. Like they're, they're If you watch, if you watch wrestling, it's it's high school. There's there's geeks, there's nerds. I mean, there's geeks, there's jocks, and there you know there is a there is a plethora of of, of people on there, and you can tell. Okay, so here's an example. Okay. Um, Ethan Page. Awesome guy. Good at wrestling. You know, takes care of his body. Works out. But he likes toys. And he's a toy collector. And, you know, whatever. And when he goes to work, when he goes to, to 
to uh, the show. Oh, uh, thank thanks for the subscribe. When he goes to work, when he goes to AEW, um, he he's passionate about what he's doing, the toys and whatever, and wrestling and all that stuff. And he shares that with you know some of the guys, but like some of the other guys that he wants to you know wrestle and talk talk to and meet, like he. He's like a fan, like, he doesn't interact, you don't see him interact with too many, too many guys. Like, too many, like, big guys, like, so, because they don't, like, they don't, they don't mess around with that stuff. No. And then, um, but he's cool with Dan Howe. There's a, there's a, there's a, there's a good group of guys that, you know, do like, you know, that stuff, but, um, none of the top guys do. None of the top guys do any of that stuff. They're all humble. So it's like, um, you're either humble or you're not. And I think if you're not humble in WWE, in wrestling, you're happier and you last a little longer, but you're the guy that gets released and signed and released and signed and you're you're just enhancement talent you're just making those guys look good so they're happy with that because they're using all that enhancement money and they're promoting themselves on on youtube and on channels like this if they let them but wwf doesn't let them no not not always i don't know i i i think that i think they i think they bent the rules with uh with xavier woods I don't know how he. I don't know how he how he bent the rule. I think because he, because he doesn't go. He doesn't film backstage. He doesn't film. Uh, he, at least he hasn't filmed it recently. I think. I think with Vince, with Vince out of power, he he they kind of bent the bent the rules a little bit. Yeah. But I don't know. Because WWE doesn't have any YouTube stuff. I mean, you, they do, but they, like, they, they don't have, like, like, this is where the people are. This is where you're gonna get views. And, like, stuff like that. And they just need the right person. You know, the right, um, the right voice. Um, you know, not a commentator that's backstage. Like, you could, you could have the guy that does interviews backstage and then has, like, you know, um, during the commercials or whatever, but there could be also a thing during the yeah, or an after raw. Like they should do that. They should do an after raw, and then um, it's like right after the show ends. There's they're right on. Like, go to TikTok. Go to after raw. Yeah. Welcome to After Raw. We're gonna talk about what ha what just happened on Monday Night Raw. Woo! Yeah. And or we could you they could have like a segment like on T live TV, and um, the TikTok gets featured on the Jumbotron, you know, or whatever the, the Titantron for for a little bit, and it's like, all right, we're live. Guys, we're on the Titantron right now. Let's go. And so, at the same time as me being on the Titantron, I'm also on USA Network. USA! USA! <laughs> and then, you know, somebody might come out into the ring and be like talking to me. I'm like, uh oh. What do you want? <laughs> Or, or it's like the backstage interview. I'm, I'm also backstage, and like we're gonna talk to some. We're talking to them right now, oh, and it's like, I don't like you people. You people make me sick. And it would bring back that old promo style. Remember the promos in WWF? The was like, oh yeah, I'm going down that night. Like I think, I think that would be perfect. The old promo style. Yeah. When I come to the ring, it's gonna be you and me. All day, every day. Oh, yeah. And then they walk, all right, he's off to the ring. 
Yeah, he got to the ring. All right. All right, we're gonna go to our TikTok correspondent right now. What's going on backstage there? Who are we talking with? All right, we're here with, with, with um, the Undertaker. And uh, the Undertaker. And then, and then it's just like it's it's just like you let them you let them you let them go and talk to the camera, and it's like it's live. Yeah, we're live. This is live. Ooh. They'll never do it though. They'll never do that. No. They'll never do it because they can't censor it. Like they can't like they can censor it on TV or whatever, but but they'll never be able to like they can't uh, there's there must be there's there's got to be like some way they can you know have it all all on simultaneously but because it's internet versus k you know cable there it's just too complicated yeah i guess clean man says oh yeah oh yeah And like they tried, like with the WWE app, they tried this. They tried like before before TikTok did it or did anything like that. Or what was that? What was that question? That quiz show? The um, what was it called? Q Q Q something? I don't know. What was that question? What was that show called? Or it was like it was an app, and it, it went every. T- it was like one like you could do it. They did it like twice a day. And like you could wait, oh, I forget what it's called. I think it still exists, but I don't remember. I don't remember what it's called. Q or something. Uh, let me let me ask Alexa here. Alexa, what is the what is that game app um, game show app? No. no. That was Alexa, what is the trivia app that came out in uh the mid two thousands? No. Oh no, musically TikTok was musically. No, um I'm trying to Trivia game show app for for phones. Yeah. Oh. Right. What was the popular trivia game show app? Quiz. Hmm. Quiz app. Quiz. Yeah, it was like it was it was Q something. Popular trivia game show app in two thousand sixteen. I don't know what it was called. It was called something Q. Something Q. I, I forget. Q. Oh man! Come on, guys. You guys gotta help me out. What? What was it called? I can't Google it right now. Oh man! I forget. Let me see. Let me see if if it's on YouTube here. Trivia game show app. Yeah. No, it wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't deal or no deal. Alright, let's see. Trivia. Game. HQ! HQ! That's what it was called. HQ! Yeah. 
Let's see if it, let's see. Alexa, is, is the HQ app still around? Yeah. The dumpster fire downfall of HQ trivia. Yeah, don't you remember, don't you remember HQ? That, that was almost perfect. There's an evolution in, in what this technology is. Um, it was done, it was done, it was done almost, almost perfectly, almost. But, it wasn't, you know, it wasn't exactly, it, the reason why it didn't work is because um, the incentive was, 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 was uh, just money. It was just like, it was like the opposite. It was like, it was like this, but the opposite. It was, they were giving away money and they weren't making any money. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I, I, I guess, I, I guess they were, it was some, you know, who knows when you joined in and you logged in and you signed in and like maybe they had you or something I don't know but then like but then there were you know other apps that came out that kind of did the same thing yeah or tried you know there was there was always there was always competition there's always competition out there always competition but yeah, Deal or No Deal was a good game show. Yeah. And I think what another thing that was a downfall was like the host, the guy, like the guy that hosted it. Um, he didn't want to do it forever. He got he got complacent. Yeah. You know, I miss watching smarter than a fifth grader. You missed that? Hmm. I only saw a little bit. Final round? I mastered the HQ trivia app. Oh. And I think that's that that probably that's probably what did happen. I think I think they, they were like, alright, this somebody broke the app. Like it, it, they broke it. They broke the code or they you know, they they um they didn't, they didn't want to, they didn't, they didn't do it anymore. Yeah. Yeah, forget that. So, it was, it was, it was, it was, it was short-lived because it, was a good idea for a minute and then it ran into the then it, then it found the problems found it you know they found their problem yeah and that's the thing with an idea ideas are great there's always great ideas but um eventually the problem you know eventually the problems find you yeah So, so that's the only problem with a good idea is, is, uh, eventually the problem, there's, the problem will come. Yeah. Oh, gee, what's up? What's that? So it's like, you always get, that's why, that's why some people are just always changing their idea. Always move it. Yeah. Oh, they're not, they don't, they don't get complacent. They don't, they don't, they don't just focus on one thing for too long. They move on. They move ahead. They evolve. Yeah. How late are you getting the on tonight? I don't know. Not not much longer. I, I don't know. I got a late. I got a late start. I I didn't feel like going live for a minute, but then I got my. I don't know. It just depends. It depends. It depends. 
Uh, not, I'm only nodding the um the subscribers now. Yeah, only only subscribers can be mods. Yeah. Only subscribers can be mods. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I figured that because if they're supporting you like that, they, they, they're definitely going to stick up for you. Yeah. PlayStation or Xbox? Like the current ones or just like of all time? Because like... Hey guys, hold on. Be right back. Let's see, let's see what this. Oh, I've paused. It paused. Oh, oh, that's because my battery just died, or my uh, my thing was about to die. One check, two, one, two. Check, 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 check. Check, 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 check. Check, 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 check. Audio is back? Okay. Audio is back. Alright. Working. Alright, we're working. We're working. Ugh. I'll tell you what, the only downfall to, to, um, I don't know if it's, if it's ventricles or if I'm just, if it's a work, uh, occupational hazard, but sometimes, sometimes it hurts, like right here, when I'm doing that, I'm like, ah. so I don't know, I guess it's a occupational hazard, what games do you play? I don't play any, I, 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 I gave it up. I gave up my gaming. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. There's something wrong with this phone or this connector. This the connection between the the two. But um, I don't know how to. I can't fix it. Like uh, I don't. I don't know. It, it, it's always it's always acting up hello hello I even replaced it I was like I, I, I'll get maybe it'll work better I don't know but it does it it doesn't seem to to want to work. I think it's I think it's my phone. I I might have to clean out the 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 thing and maybe there maybe there's something in there that's causing the connection to be like a poor connection. I don't know. 
Do you have any other puppets? I I do, but I'm not. I don't. I don't. Uh, I don't want to share my other puppets. They're, they're not till later. We're we're not we're not there yet. We're not ready for new characters yet. For adding new characters yet. We have to we have to build our we have to build Phil up, you know. Make Phil famous and then and then we'll get the other puppets, you know. That that's my goal. Like let's make Phil let's make Phil a trending celebrity, a tick like a TikTok we want we wanna make Phil TikTok famous and then that'll be next. And I mean you guys, I don't wanna ma like I'm I'm not saying that you know, I'm gonna be famous, but I, 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 I want the same thing that everybody would else w would want is to make somebody famous. And since, since I don't like to put myself over, I put Phil over. Yeah. And um, I think honestly, um. If I just keep going and 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 keep going, eventually somebody will see it. Somebody that has somebody that has influence or whatever. It takes sometimes it takes influence to create more influence or whatever. I don't know. I don't. Let's just say. I can't, I can't rely on somebody else's fame to make me famous. I can, but I shouldn't, because then you're always going to be that guy that got famous because of that other person, like Dr. Phil. Like Dr. Phil, um, he wouldn't be where he is if he didn't have Oprah to, you know, jump, you know, he jumped on her coattails. And I'm not saying he did a bad thing, but, you know, if you if you ride somebody's coattails long enough, you, you're bound to get famous. But um, people are gonna go, you know, whatever. And then and then Oprah, you know, Oprah, she doesn't even do. I, I, I don't know what she does now. Like she, she barely does anything. She has a network, and once in a while she interviews people, like whenever she wants on her channel. Like she's got her own, she's got her own thing. Like she doesn't, like that's how big she is. She's just like, I don't need you anymore. That's what she said to like ABC and whatever. She created her own network where she can say and do whatever she wants, and she's the boss. Like that's how good she is. And like not everybody likes her like like that. You know, there's people that just don't. You know that are bitter and jealous and whatever, I don't know, they're, they're looking for a reason not to like her or whatever, but she, she became an icon, and she, she, you know, she talked about things she loved and liked, and she tried to help people, and whenever there was an issue, she talked about it, like, some, at some point, she talked about it, she, she was a voice, One, like, she was a great voice, and, like, yeah, you know, my mom watched her religiously. It was like Oprah's on, Oprah's on, and you had to watch Oprah. She talked to celebrities. She talked to people. She had different. She had different. Like every show, she had a different, a different topic or a different thing go on. But it was just, it's just amazing. And then, um. And then, um, like, there was Rosie O'Donnell. Rosie O'Donnell had her show, and that was great. Rosie became a sensation. And there were, you know, there was, all, there was a bunch of My mom loved, my mom loved, like, um, Regis and Kathy Lee and, like, stuff like that. She liked stuff where they talked about things. And, like, it was like, you know, it was real. It wasn't, uh, it wasn't a, um, you know... It, like they talked to real, they talked to regular people, and they had regular people on and whatever. It wasn't. I can't explain it, but it wasn't like. Um, it wasn't like as cheesy or scripted. It was unscripted. 
and it was live. It was live television. And anything, I think that was the thing. It's like anything can happen on this show. Anything, yeah, anything. Like there could be somebody in the crowd that they that that, that they see and they're like, "What are you doing over there?" Or, or I, I can't explain it. And she got to go to it. She got. She went. She went to um, New York, and she went to the. Um, she went to Regis and Kathy Lee once at their studio, and I can't remember who who was the who was the um, guest. I don't remember if she got a picture with them or not, but I remember her going to that. Oh, I just can't remember who, who was on the show. I think she got a picture with Regis, too. And, um, I'm trying to think. Like, she loved it. Like, that's why she went. Like, she wanted to meet Regis. So. My mom met Regis Philbin. And this was before Who Wants to Be a Millionaire and all that stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Do you come on all the time? <laughs> For the most part, you know, I have my days where I go, you know, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna go on. So, all the time, yes, I don't know. Most of the time. Let's just say most of the time. Because I, I, I have my moments, you know, I work, cause sometimes I work and I'm just too exhausted and just like, <sighs> you can't watch a guy that's, um, you can't watch a guy on here that's like, <sighs> uh, it's just not, it doesn't work, it doesn't work that way. I mean, you could, but it gets boring. And like high end, that you can have high energy or low energy, I don't know, it just depends on like, what kind of information, or what kind of, like, I don't know. It's like, I don't know what I want. I know what I want, but I don't know what I want. Like, I don't mean, like, it's, it's just like, it's like you want that instant gratification, or that instant, like, oh, I went live and I had those views. Like, I want to get through that moment, then I can, like I, like, I need that. I need that moment where I hit I hit a view count where I'm like stressed out. I need to like I need that. Like when it's calm like this, when there's just a few people talking, it's calm. I can you know, I feel I feel fine. It's like the no pressure there's no pressure. But I need that pressure. And then that'll tell me whether I can I can do it or not. And um, I just can't wait for that day when the pressure's on. Now I can I can stress myself out. I can like you know, um, oh, what's the word? Like like lose my cool and like get angry or upset and like I'll get views that way. But they're not watching me. They're just watching me get upset and lose my lose my lose my cool. And like that guy's so, that's sad. Like it's just like it's not it's not what it's not what I want. It's like and um I don't know, it's just it's hard it's hard to say. And like you can argue with somebody in the chat and argue back and forth and then whatever, but then you gotta be afraid because if you say something you say the wrong thing they're gonna, they're gonna, they're gonna put the thing on you, the report, and they're gonna report you, and then you're gonna get, you're gonna get suspended or whatever. It's happened to me. I mean, I haven't, I, I, I don't remember saying anything, or if I did say something, I don't know what that guy said. So it's like I'm confused. Like you, you could be live and saying, you know, just talking, like whatever. It's like, and and you're just like, what did I say? My mind, you know, I, like, it's like, you don't know what you said, there's, especially when there's multiple people talking, you don't know who you, you don't know who, who you hurt somebody's feelings, you, you just don't, so it's like, you either don't talk to the chat, or you do, and when you do, it's like, you gotta watch what you say, you gotta be careful, and you can't be, you can't, you can't be super friend, over friendly, you know, because um, 
people take it the wrong way. And, like, they don't mean to. Like, they don't mean to, like... I don't know. It's like... Um... Um... Some people will bait you into liking them. And, you know, they, they bait you and bait you and they, you know, they, they, they call, they, 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 they say your name and you get, you get a good feeling in your chest. You're just like, oh my God, this is awesome. He sees me. He sees me. But what, what, what the other guy doesn't realize, he doesn't realize how, how, he doesn't realize how that feeling is until he gets that feeling. When he gets acknowledged, it's like, oh, that's what that feels like. So if you know what that feels like, you know, you don't want to hurt, you don't want to, like, you, like, it's just like, you know, it's a special moment. And you don't want to ruin that person's moment by, you know, like, because, like, they could, you could be, like, really cool one day and alive and, like, they want, they love that feeling, so they come back. So you got to keep. And um, if you if you make yourself believe that, it just hurts because like it's just like it's a, it's not really you. It's like a it's it's a pretend you, and you're just like yeah, you know, you're like I'm happy right now, but I'm not really happy. You know, I don't know. The freezing lag. Oh no. Oh no. Lagging. Could be internet connection. I don't know. I'm not getting any any negative stuff, but I don't know. Gustavo. Gustavo. You can come on the Gustavo. Alright, I'm gonna well no, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna um I'm gonna I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna unplug this, take these off, and just go go un unplug for a minute. Not unplug. What? I'd be supporting this charity from West Africa. It breaks my heart. Hmm. <sighs> you want some advice? Do you like dogs? I love dogs. I think... I think... We should be supporting people in our own backyards before we should support other people's backyards. Like, um, I don't know. What happened to Phil? Phil's, Phil's taking a little break. Seems like different life than America. It breaks my heart. But it's a cool charity. Yeah, well, it is. It's it's completely different. They have different laws. They have different different um different ways they they live their life. It's it's completely different. The society like our society was built by every society. Like like just everybody came here everybody and now it's now it's it's just a big bowl of fruit loops and you know they all taste the same but they're all different you know, different, uh, different colors and all that stuff. And then you got lifesavers that are different flavors. Or starbursts, like we're starbursts. 
or whatever. We're we're a mixed bag. But everybody that's here came here to get away from their own, you know, their own land. They left. So, in some way, the people that came here in the beginning are all cowards. Just depends on the way you look at it. Because, uh, I don't want to say they were cowards, but like, they didn't like the way things were going in their own land, so they left. They came here. Thanks, One Rib. You know, so that they could have, so that they could have a better life. But when they got here, they realized uh, they realized they were stealing somebody else's home. Like somebody was already here, and they were just like, "Oh, I don't care. I'm gonna live here too," or you know, "I'm better than you." You know, so it's like it's like you're no better than the person you just left. So while you were getting shooed out of your homeland, you're shooing somebody else out of their homeland. It's just, it's just a hypo It's being a hypocrite. Yeah. Or just tall. Sorry, don't realize. Still wasn't on the screen. Oh, it's okay. On deck. And that's what creates all the disconnect and and you know negativity and stuff like that and it's a power struggle it's always a power struggle power everybody wants to be right everybody wants to have all the money and the control in order yeah. and it always changes but it always goes it always backfires too it's because if everybody gives power to one thing there's gonna, it's just going to create problems. And sometimes there's stupid problems. Like, I, I, I just, I don't, I don't, I, you know, I don't want to get into it, but like, um, when it comes to like an issue with using the bathroom, it's just like, use the damn bathroom. Yeah. It's like, what are you, what are you going to do in there? Right. You're going to go take a piss, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. That's what it's for, right? Yeah. If they do anything else th that's not that, then they deserve to get what they get. Yeah. If you go if you go into a bathroom and you rob somebody or hurt somebody or beat somebody up uh, in the bathroom, then you deserve to get in trouble or you deserve whatever you get. Yeah. And the guy or other person that is the other you know gets the other end of the stick um they 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 they, they warned you yeah they warned you you know the signs were there before you started doing that so you know um the problem the pro you invented the problem you know you invented it was your idea you created the problem. If you don't want the problem, then don't think of the idea. Yep. That's what I say about that. Yep. Only only one person can invent something, and then everybody else steals it. Yeah, everybody else borrows it. Or copies it. Let's just put it that way. One person does something and then everybody else copies it. It's a it's a it's a carbon copy. Yeah, how are you? I'm good. You know, like one person started ventriloquism. One guy or one girl <gasps> one person and then other people said, I like doing that. I'm gonna learn how to do that. Or I'm gonna do that. Yeah. And the first guy didn't like that at first. He's like, no, because I want all the attention. So they, they, but then after they see the next guy and see how horrible he did, he's not as worried. Yeah. But then the next guy or the next girl or the next, you know, tries and, and then one person is just like better. It's like, oh, he's better than you. How? I don't know. 
but he's better. But that's only in his mind that he's better. He's better. He's better to you, you know, because um, you only know you can only gauge what you did, and he's just doing the same thing. So he's not better as you. He's as good as you. Yeah. You created the the. You created it. Nobody can be better than you. You were first. People can be as good as you, but they can't be better than you. So, like, I can't be better than Jeff Dunham. No matter what I do, I can't be better than him. He, 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 a, a, as far as being the top ventriloquist in the world, he probably is. He's probably top. He's strong, you know. So, I could get there. I could get on his level, maybe, but maybe not. Like, you know, there's guys that, you know, are... are 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 hanging back out of respect and they look up to Jeff Dunham like Terry Fader probably the biggest Jeff Dunham fan ever yeah and he you know he did that he went to Vegas he got he got big and he's you know he's a top guy but he'll forever be um he'll forever be under um Jeff Dunham. Same thing with like anything like Muhammad Ali. Let's just say Muhammad Ali is the the greatest boxer of all time, or was the greatest boxer of all time because he's a legend. Nobody like people can probably beat his records and stuff like that, but they'll never beat him. They'll never be better than him, no matter what they do. Yeah. The like they'll never want to take that person's like place. They'll ne they'll never do it. Yeah, it's like it's like history. Yeah. It's like George Washington, the first president. He did it he he was first. Was he the best? Arguably no. But he was the first, so he's got he's he's remembered, he'll be remembered forever. Yeah. He'll always be on top. Even when he isn't, he's there. He's the first. He was first. Yeah. Woo. I had a cheeseburger. Woo. We're gonna get there. I hope. I hope so. So what's the point of your conversation? My point is... Um, you can spend your whole life trying to be number one, but um, you should spend it trying to be number two or, or whatever. You should, because unless you're the first, you're not. You'll never be number one. Never be number one. You'll be the. You'll be the. You'll be your number forever. Your number? Yeah. If I'm like the hundredth and hundred and eighty nine thousand. Uh, like ventriloquist on TikTok, that's my number. Yeah. I'll never be higher, I'll never be lower. Will I be number one on TikTok? Maybe. Yeah, maybe not. I don't know. I'm not, let's just say I'm not trying to be number one. I'm not trying to be. I would like to be. I think it would be cool. I think it would be cool to be famous or a celebrity and stuff like that. I think it would be cool. But um I'm not I'm not going to try. I'm just going to, you know, work my butt off or whatever this is. Just just, you know, just play the play the long game. Play the long game. And if it happens, it happens. Ooh, and everybody knows how the app works. Everybody knows how the algorithm works. Everybody knows how to get famous on TikTok. No, like, or the, or they can learn. Everybody has has you know. There's people that teach you on YouTube and teach you like they they give you advice like oh this is what you have to do. You have to do all this stuff, and it's just like well that's what I had to do. It's like. It's like no, you don't have to do all that. Yeah. If I wanted to, I could I could pay TikTok to promote my live. I could pay them a lot of money or a little bit of money a, a week, and the, they'll bump me out to see to to more viewers. Yeah. 
And, you know, I could do that. Or I could I could ask you guys to share my live to all your followers. And then, you know, they would come in for a second or two. Yeah, but... But they wouldn't stay. Because they, they you know, they're either doing something or whatever. So it's like... You gotta, like, it's like you gotta do this. You gotta be consistent every day at the same time, and then eventually, yeah, people watch. People will watch. Ask Donald Trump to get me on. <laughs> nah, I don't think I don't think he'll I don't think he'll listen to me. Nah. underneath Double Studios. What's up, Double Studios? Hey. He might. I mean, he might, but it's just like... Um... I feel like that's that's a low point. If you have to... If you have to beg a celebrity or somebody to watch you, like, to come watch you, to feel bad for you, I don't need that. Yeah. A former president has a lot of power. Yeah. Oh, he had power even before he was president. That's why he won. Yeah. He had all the power during that election. But he lost it. When uh, when the Democrats turned on him. Yeah. He had he had power and then and then the Democrats turned on him. Yeah. He's going to help you with AGT. He might. He might. Maybe. If I get on it, he might. You know, I don't know. They don't... They, those networks don't... You are Those networks are kind of iffy with the... With the... Um, with the... Um, the right. Yeah. So, I don't know. I, I think I'm... I think as far as political parties go, you, you got to leave that out of it. Yeah. He's gonna help. I'm not a. I'm not a politics person. I don't care about right wing and left wing. I don't care. It's, it's just like you know. I just care what's best for 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 uh, you know. I, just what's best for people. And what I you know what I, I you know what I like strong think strongly about. Yeah. But what I think, like I said, I think strongly about ideas, and every idea has problems. Yeah. So my advice is if you have an idea, think about it before you, you know, before you put it on paper or think about it and put it before you, before you put it to, to, uh, before you bring it to life. Yeah. Because you, you don't know, you don't know until, until the problems start. Yeah. Overstrain at his businesses. Yeah. Maybe. You never know. You never know. Never say never. Or I could say never. Let's just say never. Never. I'm never going to do that. It's never going to happen. <laughs> so we're never going to be famous? No, nope, never. They're never gonna. They're never gonna be famous. Never gonna be famous. Paul, how tired are you? I'm not tired, actually. I'm actually okay. I get. I get. But I do get kind of like you know. It just. I'm just a mellow. I th at this time and I. I'm just mellow. Yeah. Hey, they'll just stop by to say hi, but bye. What was the point? Yeah. I've been here for a while. Like, what's, what's the point in even doing that? Yeah, I don't get it. What a waste of energy. No offense. But that's a waste of energy. I 
feel like I feel like we need to stop giving people attention that don't deserve it. Like that. I'm not gonna. Sorry, sorry, my guy, but. If you're not gonna come to my live and like whatever and like be here, like, and you're just gonna say hi, I, I don't need that. Whatever. No offense, though. No offense. Serious stands only. <laughs> but you realize you have to build the audience first. Yeah. But that's not an audience. That's just a that's just a guy that came in and out, you know? True, a customer has to a true customer would, would buy something. Yeah. Would buy what you're selling. True. If you I, that's why I don't walk into businesses unless I'm gonna buy something. If if uh if you're going to the mall, don't go in that store unless you're gonna buy. Yeah. Because um, that person that's in there is going to try to sell it to you. And they probably will. Yeah, they probably will. I'm not saying you can't. I'm just saying you shouldn't because that's the goal. Just like when you go to a, a car a, to... to Nobody go, Nobody drives into the car lot and just walks around and goes, Oh, I'm just looking. Nobody does that. You go there when you when you're want when you actually want to buy. Yeah. Ooh, you I mean you still gotta you still gotta test drive and you know, sit in the car and like, you know, get a feel for it. Get some knowledge. Yeah. But you're going to buy like it's like we're gonna buy you're, like like we're gonna we're we're he interested in buying. Yeah. We're interested in spending our money. Yeah. So sometimes when you're when you're alive when you're a person that's live, you gotta think like a salesman. Like what what can I how, what can I do to get you in this car today? Yeah. No, I'm just kidding. I don't I don't wanna sound like a used car salesman or a game show host. Game show host! Yeah! Alright, Phil. We gotta think of... We gotta write a song. We do. We gotta be like... I go live on TikTok almost every night. I go on when the time is right. But when is the time right? When is the time right, Phil? I don't know. I'll check my watch. Hopefully they see my crutch. <laughs> no, just kidding. Hopefully they don't see my crutch. Till I see it. Ah! I just want to make them smile. Maybe they'll stay a while. There you go, that's good. Ready? Try it again. I go live almost every night. I go on when I'm feeling right. Hopefully they'll come and watch. And maybe they might see Paul's crotch. <gasps> I hope they love my show until it's time to go. If you stay for just a minute, I might show you how I spin it. I just want to be your friend. Until this life comes to an end. I might not remember your smile. But I know I need you. For a while. 
Sunday soon will be on top. Hopefully this light won't stop. We get happy, we get sad. We get angry and mad. But some days we get scared. And we are always prepared for the fear of sadness. But then our smiles turn to, our frowns turn to smiles. And everybody is happy again. again. Happy again, we're happy again. No reason to be sad or happy again. Happy, happy, happy. Happy, 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 happy. This is my happy song and I sing it all day long. I listen the words so I can sing along. Happy, happy, happy. Do, 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 do. Happy, 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 happy. This is my happy song and I sing it all day long. Listen the words so I can sing along. Oh, happy, 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 happy. Happy, 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 happy. Happy, 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 happy. This is my happy song and I sing it all day long. Listen the words so I can sing along. Is this the real life? Is this just fantasy? Caught in a landslide, no escape, no reality. Open your eyes, look up to the skies and see. I'm just a poor boy, I need no sympathy. Because I'm easy come, easy go, little high, little low. Anyway, the wind blows doesn't really matter to me. To me, boom, 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 la la. Just killed a man. Put a gun against his head. Pulled the trigger. Now he's dead. No, no, lies had just begun, but now I've got it, thrown it all away. No, no, didn't need to make you cry. Thought not back again this time tomorrow. Carry on, carry on, as if nothing really mattered. Do 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 do. Too late. My time has come. Sent shivers down my spine. Bodies aching all the time. Goodbye, everybody. I got to go. Girl, in your behind and face the truth. Mama, I don't wanna die. Sometimes wish I never been born at all. I see a little silhouette of an ant Scarabush, Scarabush Lead to the thunder, I'm all thunder But a lightning, they're there, they're frightening me Galileo, can
Galileo, 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 Easy come, easy go, and then they go, peace me, Lord, no, we won't let you go, peace me, Lord, no, we won't let you go, never will not let you go, never will not let you go, then they go, no, 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 I'm on the knee, 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 I'm so you think you can stop me and stay denied? So you think you can love me and then you to die? No, baby. Can't do this to me, baby. Just gotta get out. Just gotta get right out of here. Yeah, dare. I said dare. I said dare, dare. I said dare, where are you? Why would you say truth or dare if you didn't want to hear any answer? I said dare. Hello? What a waste. Dare! Hello? Are you daring? What a joke. What the heck was the point of that? If you're not gonna actually do the, uh, like, say the dare, why say truth or dare? Stupid. Stupid! Annoying! Is the guy that records me launching? Mega Man, are you launching? Where's Mega Man? We gotta talk to Mega Man. I wanna talk to him. I think I think we need to I think his channel needs a little a little tweak. Yeah. Mega Man, are you watching? Mega Man I don't know what your name is on here. Is it is it too thin? Is too thin this Negan Nan? Too thin this Jack? Are you Negan Nan? Who's Negan Nan? Negan Nan, the guy that screen records my, my lives, where are you? Is he watching? Hello, I'm trying to contact you about your car insurance. Chili peppers and roses. Oh, fancy. Mega Man, where are you? I don't know what his name is on here. I thought it was. Is he watching? Wait. Yeah, he's watching. He's right there. I see him. I see his, his name pumped up. Follow me. Follow me! Yeah, that's him. Right? That's him. Hardhead Mario. Hardhead Mario! I know you can hear me. Tight, tight, tight! Come on. I ha I have to, I have to, I have to tell you something. Tight something. 
tight something hard head Larry. I have I have I have some advice. Another, another something good to help your channel. Yeah. You can call it Phil's Fun Network. Yeah, Phil's Fun Network. A place where you go watch the lines. Yeah, if you missed if you missed the live, go to the Phil's Fun Network on YouTube. Yeah, subscribe today. Woo. Or you could call it Phil's Fun Vlogs too. Yeah! And you'll get partnered. Yeah, you'll get partnered and everything. You get your gold plaque. That would be cool. On YouTube? Yeah! But I'll be the famous YouTuber. <laughs> yeah. It's just a suggestion, though. Yeah. Just a suggestion. Whew. And how would I do that? Yeah, I, 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 I don't even know how to do that. Who is that? Who are they talking about? I don't know. Yeah. Sorry, I don't know how to do that impression. No, I can't. I, 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 I had no idea how to even start. I don't know where to begin, know where to end. Yeah. My name is... That's great. Nice to meet you. Yeah. But unfortunately, I can't, I can't do what you, I, I, I can't, I can't, um, what you're asking, I can't. I don't. I don't have that. I don't have. I don't have the. I don't have the impression down. It's not. It's not in my. It's not in my. Um. It's not in my impression list. Yeah. And I don't do impressions. You don't do impressions. Yeah, I don't do them. I'm not an impressionist. I'm a, I'm I'm just still I'm a boring puppet on TikTok. I feel special sometimes. I feel special sometimes. When the times are tough and the times are rough, I feel special sometimes. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I like to eat, eat. Eat apples and bananas. I like to oat, 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 oatles and the no nos. I like to oat, 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 oatles and the no nos. I like to at, 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 apples and the not nots. I like to at, 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 
Apples and the nut nuts. I like to eat, 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 eat apples and the nanays. I like to eat, 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 eat apples and the nanays. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and the nanas. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and the nanas. I, I don't want to go home, but I got to go home for dinner. I, I don't want to go home, but I got to go home for dinner. Talking about you, talking about me, talking about ecology. That's the way you and me can help the world. Do 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 do. Ronald McDonald taught me that one. He did. Talking about you, talking about me, talking about ecology. That's the way you and me can help the world. Do 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 do. Ronald McDonald came to my school when I was young. Yes, he did. We used to have assemblies in school. They were so fun. Elementary school assemblies rock! We had the, like, a state policeman came and he talked about stuff. And he had a comic book. He had his own comic book made. Yeah, Trooper Ash. Yeah, Trooper Ash was his comic. I don't know who drew his comic and who did it all, but they their art was perfect. Yeah, I wish we I wish we still had one of his things. Yeah. I don't know, maybe somebody put one online somewhere. We can see. I don't know. I think the guy passed away though. Yeah, I don't know. There, he became the ant on there once, yeah. I saw him years ago when I was still at Kmart, like in 2006. Yeah. I made a video about it. It has to be true. Yeah. It, it's, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a um, um, a virtual audition though. It's not the it's not the main show. I st it's just like a it's just like a a one on one. It's a virtual audition, and I could I could possibly get picked later on. But it's something. Yeah, it's something. We're, we're gonna try. We can at least try. Yeah. Good luck. Right. Yeah. Gonna, we're gonna try our hand in it. Yeah. Ooh. We're gonna try our best to do it. Ooh. And while we try, we're gonna go viral on TikTok. Yeah. So, either either I make it on American Idol and become a big celebrity and then go viral on TikTok or I go viral on TikTok and become a big celebrity. One of those two things is going to happen first. Yeah. I don't know which one. But but you know, I I, I can I can play it safe and play the long game or I can take a risk. Yeah. And the worst I the worst I do is do it a, a virtual audition. That's it. Yeah. I just do the virtual audition. Yep, I do it and then that's it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But I'm telling you right now guys, my goal is not to be um a, a snobby celebrity that doesn't care about anybody. Like I'm not changing, you know, I'm not going to be, like, a flashy celebrity. Like, I'm not doing that. I'm going to be me. 
and I'm gonna use my I'm gonna I'm not gonna say my but I'm gonna use the I'm gonna use the the um can't think think of the word I can't think of the word I'm gonna use the influence that I get to influence people to be good people yeah Ooh. and I'm going to distract all the ones that aren't good people Woo. and no matter how many accounts no matter how many accounts I get you know I can start a new account and and I'll already have a following so it won't matter so so I, I, I I'm gonna I'm that's what I need I just need I just need that one thing and then they can't touch me. No. Nope. And I'm going to use my fame to make you guys money. That's another thing. Yeah. And that's anybody. Ooh, because I know I'm money. Yeah, I'm money. Ooh. Just don't forget about us little little me. Yeah. Ooh, I'll support y'all to the end. I'm gonna help small creators and small businesses. Yeah. Make big things. And and the way I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give them all. If you're a small business, um, I can say this now until forever. If you're a small business, put my mug on your stuff. Yeah. Sell me. Yeah, that's all I gotta say. Sell me. All of you guys that are watching hear me right now, sell me. Sell me. Sell me to your sell me to your to your audience. Yeah. Tell them what you think of me. And then tell me what you think of you. Tell me what I think of you. Yeah. Or introduce yourself to me. Yeah, that 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 kind of stuff. Yeah. I should start on pretty decent at selling images with thread. Aw. No, I was thinking you could make I don't know if you want to do this, but get a Velcro patch. Like just a Velcro patch and then any patch I can just detach and put stuff on. On a, on a shirt and like it doesn't have to it can be like like whenever like if it's Christmas time psst, Christmas shirt if it's um, if it's just a regular live TikTok emblem if it's or it feels fun you know the feels fun brand if we don't want to promote TikTok as much you know I don't know it's, yeah I don't know I think I think that would be cool. WWE wrestling, yeah. We were just talking about wrestling earlier. That would be that would be smart. I could totally do that for Phil. Yeah, I appreciate it. But you'd have to let me send it. Don't worry. Any day now. Any day now. Yeah, any day now we're going to get that 30K. Any day. Woo. But we need your help and your help and your help and your help. Yeah. You watching this YouTube video on this channel, on, on Mega Man's channel. I know this is this is this is live right now, but I'm talking to Mega Man 
Mega Man's YouTube video right now. Yeah. And Mega Man wants you to subscribe to his channel. Yeah. And Mega Man's going to rename the channel to the Phil's Fun Network. Yeah. No, I don't know. That would be cool if he did. Woo. You could call the videos that Phil's Fun Network. Yeah. Phil's, Phil's Fun Live. Yeah, or something. On YouTube. Honestly, I'm excited and happy I ended finding a super cool box and little things to go with it. Aww. That's cool. Phil's Fun YouTube. That's a good idea. Phil's Fun YouTube. Yeah! Anything. But here's the thing. I want your channel to go viral. I want you, I want you to get partnered on YouTube. Yeah! And I think if you, if you sell me as your content... It'll happen, and the the best thing is, I'll become a famous YouTuber. But you get all the fun, you get all the awards, you get you get all you get everything, you get all the views, you get all the plaques that they send you, and all the revenue. Yeah. And it's just me as 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 the as the content. Yeah. Oh. You will be, I'll be a famous everything. Yeah, I'll be a famous, I'll just be famous in general. Yeah. YouTube world famous, or at least American famous. Yeah, or something. I also have a channel. Good, good. Well, if you want any advice, is um, just like I, honestly, I'm saying this right now. If you screen record me or screen record a live or something like that or a video of mine and you meme it and, or like make a meme or something, I want to see that. I'm gonna, I, I'm, I'm actually doing this. All right, meme challenge. Yeah. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna make a video. I'm gonna say uh, this is a meme challenge. Meme what? Meme my content. Meme my content. Yeah. Woo. Or or meme this live. Yeah. Just tell me what to say. Yeah. Tell us what to say. You give me the script. That's what we're gonna do right now. All right. Right now. For everybody, I want, uh, if you want to make a meme, if you can, if you're good at editing videos and stuff like that, editing TikToks, screen screen record this and tell me what to say. Yeah. Tell me what you want. Tell me what you want to say right now. Okay. Yeah. And make a meme. We'll say whatever you want, or we'll try our best to say, you know, whatever, like, whatever. Say it. Let's go. Come on, it's a me it's a meme challenge. One of you guys is gonna go viral on TikTok. You never know. Okay. We're waiting for them. Give us give us some give us a script. Yeah, tell us what to say. What are we saying? What's our line? We need a line. Somebody give us a line. Line, please. I need a line. Okay. Are you serious right now, bro? Are you serious right now, bro? I'm dead serious. I'm dead serious. Are you serious right now, bro? Are you serious right now, bro? Are you serious now, bro? All right. I 
think that's it. <laughs> Woo! Three, two, one! Are you serious right now, bro? Nice try. All right, let's see. Script. All right. Thank you for the happiest year of my life. Don't try. Do it. Yeah. Are you serious right now, bro? <laughs> All right, right now, guys, we are, we are, we are, we want you to screen, screen record us and tell us what to say and make a meme or make a TikTok. Make, edit, edit, edit your own tic, custom TikTok. Yeah. And you feed us the lines. That's what we're doing right now. Yeah. Woo. Come on, guys. Let's go. Wow, you're still on? I'm still on. Oh, you need to go to bed. Oh, I'm not tired. You have to go. All right, bye. Have a good one. We got to do this tomorrow, too. Yeah, we'll do this tomorrow. When, we'll do it early when we get when we first go live. It'll be it'll be another fun thing we can include in the show. Yeah. Meme this video! Yeah, bye! Peace out. Ooh. Script, say happy, happy. Happy, happy, happy! Happy, 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 happy! What could Chuck... Oh, wait. What could it would Chuck... Do if the woodchuck could chuck, but if the woodchuck can't chuck, what happens? <laughs> this is my happy song, and I sing it all day long. Don't say it. What? Don't say what? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. I, 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 I won't. I, I'm not. I'm not saying all those things. Yeah. Listen the words so I can sing along. Make sure you report too, guys. Always report. Yeah. If it if it if it's if it's like that, always report. Cause those are toxic people. Toxic. Don't worry, guys. I won't read the if, if it's if they're trolling me. I won't. I won't read that. Worst case scenario, I get a meme made out of me for something else. Yeah. We're gonna go viral. We're gonna be a viral meme. So we're gonna get famous somehow here, guys. Yeah. Usually twice, sometimes three things. Yeah. 
Make me famous! Yeah! Let's go! It's up to you guys in TikTok land. To make me famous! Woo. And if you want to be famous before me, we'll get in here. Yeah! Let's see. Let's see how famous you can be. Woo! Because if I can't be famous first, I want you to be famous first. Yeah! If I can't be famous, I'd love to see you. If I can't be famous, I'd rather see you. Because <laughs> if I can't be famous, then at least you can. Woo! I'm just trying to support you, not make it big. <laughs> if you don't want to make it big, I'm going to do it for you. Yeah! If you don't want to be a celebrity, I'll be your celebrity. Yeah. If you don't have a celebrity crush, we'll be your celebrity crush. Yeah. If you want to hate a celebrity, I'm your guy. Yeah. If you want to love a celebrity, I'm your guy. Yeah. Talk about me. That's what I say. Talk to me, guy. Talk to me, Pop. Talk to me. But I could only get reduced price on backstage pages. That'd be cool. Reduced prices? All right, we'll hook you up. We got a scalper in the back. Yeah. You're already my crush. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I blush, I blush. Alright, I think we gotta go to bed now. Er er Eric convinced me. Eric! Eric, you convinced Polly to end. No! We'll be back tomorrow. We're gonna do this again tomorrow. Memes! Screen record, screen record your memes tomorrow. That's what we're gonna do tomorrow. Wait, wait. Are we gonna do that tomorrow? Alright, we'll figure something out because... I forgot it's Friday and we're we got plans. So maybe if we go live tomorrow, maybe. Yeah. We're supposed to go away, but we might we'll still be live over the weekend. Just we'll just be somewhere else. Yeah, we're gonna be we're gonna go see my friends. Bye. We'll be we'll be we'll be visiting some friends, but we still might go live. Yeah, we'll go live for sure. And we'll do this we'll do this there. Okay, we'll do it there. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do it there. Woohoo! Who is it? Summer? No, no, no. Star's house, yeah. We're going to Star's house. Not summer. Not summer! Summer time! Have a great sleep day weekend. Stay safe. Okay. Okay. Alright, guys. We'll see ya. See you soon. We'll see ya real soon. Yeah! Alright, bye.